What's up guys, my name is Soapsy and welcome back to another FIFA 21 video. Today we're going to talk about how to get this headliner's Cunha card. Is it worth it? Yes, I think so. So let's jump straight into the objectives. Obviously, starting off, we've got score and outside of the box goal. This might be one that you might get naturally. Obviously, the finesse is a chance for that outside the box. But also, if you're playing against uh, someone else who decides to do the objectives with you and you decide to just get the outside the box objective done, that's probably an easy way to do it is to agree with someone. Yep, we'll score one each, job done. Um, the second one is to score and assist using Brazilian players. I'm going to sort that out with a team that I'm going to show you in a second on how to do this easier. Obviously, it's in two separate wins, so you're going to need to grind out a win with it. It's going to be kind of difficult, but two goals isn't too bad. So that's a kind of hard objective, but not too bad. Um, another one, assist a through ball using players with minimum four star. That's going to be no problem with the team that I've built. Um, uh, that's for weak foot in three separate wins. So again, these wins, if you get the two, the goal and assist in the two wins, they'll all count as the same with the three wins there as well. Uh, win four matches, again, should all count together towards the same thing. So you should only have to win four in theory. Um, and then, of course, you need to play four, 10 separate games anyway that you stay until the end. So scoring 10 separate matches using Bundesliga players. And again, I'm going to address that with the team that we've got. Um, so this should be a reasonably easy objective to do. And you should be able to get most of these things done as you're winning games anyway. So let's jump straight into the team. So EA have set up this headliners challenge. Uh, this is the mode that you have to do it in. Obviously the requirements you can see on the screen are that there is a minimum of seven leagues. So this shouldn't be an issue with the team that I've built and obviously Brazil is the theme that I've gone for. So let's jump straight in and I'll show you the team. Um, obviously this is where having done those freeze loans is gonna pay dividends. Even if you didn't do the main cards or if you did do the main cards, as long as you got the loans, you can use them in this objective. Perfect and very, very helpful. So looking at the team, the way that I've built this out is I start at the top um, looking at the strikers. Xiao Victor, Bundesliga, Brazil, meets all the requirements to try and do the objectives. Very, very helpful. Uh, he's also got a five-star weak foot, so he hits the four-star weak foot part. Teixeira, different league, obviously. The Chinese league helps for your leagues. Four-star weak foot, again, very helpful, very sweaty. Uh, everyone's going to have this Roberto Firmino card likely as well. He's obviously got himself a nice four-star week for Premier League, different player. If you manage to pick up Rodrigo from the objectives, obviously you can go get his regular card. You can go get any of these Brazilian cards that you need for this. Uh, he's also got himself a four-star week for left-hand side. Felipe Anderson, he's one. You could also use Everton as well. Um, there, He's obviously from the Portuguese league, which helps build on that leagues for seven leagues. Um, also, you've got Marquinhos in here. He doesn't have a weak foot, but likelihood is if you're setting him to stay back as the CDM, he's not going to be assisting goals anyway. Um, he's obviously hits for the league. Un. And then, of course, I managed to have myself this, uh, this uh, Perez card, which is a fantastic card. I packed it untradeable. Um, obviously, you can get his regular card, and that just helps out at the back for the different leagues. You could even build into a completely different back four, but just for Kem's sake, I went with the four Brazilians. Uh, La Liga as well, I've hit at the back here with Edo Militao and Diego Carlos, both very sweaty, Brazilian, they link perfectly. And Marcelo was just there for chemistry purposes. Pacheco is just in there because I had him, he was the La Liga keeper I already had. Um, and you could really go and get anyone if you want to spend the cash. If you want to get this done easier, you can go buy yourself Courtois to stay in there, both very, very good keepers. Uh, in terms of scoring with Bundesliga players, though, I will say the best way to do this is if you've got your Brazil objective done or if you're in game and you've done the Brazil objective for that game, then, of course, you're going to want to have some Bundesliga subs. Cheap options. You've got Huang Hee Chan. Obviously, you don't have to have his ones to watch. There's also Rashica, who's a fantastic card. Look for him at center forward. He's from Kosovo. Um, plays Word of Bremen. Sane, another great option. Uh, I mean, if you've got any of the player of the months, whether you've got Haaland, if you've got Lewandowski, of course, you can bring those ones off the bench. There's no rating requirement in this, which is going to make it quite difficult. Uh, Bailey was one of the freeze ones that you could have done. Uh, and also Komen as an objective card. And then, of course, if you're just straight up looking for the win, you've already scored a Bundesliga goal with Xiao Victor. Then, of course, you've got other cards that you'd like bringing on. If you have any subs that you use, any ones that you normally would use to try and clutch out games. I've got Dembele, I've got Kappa as a defensive sub, I've also got De La Feo, these are ones that I like. But realistically, just be creative. You could go for an entirely different league, but obviously it makes more sense trying to do that Brazilian objective to go with the Brazilian team. So that's the team that I've gone for, guys. Um, obviously, you can vary it, you can change up the back four, they're not really going to need to be involved as long as you hit those seven leagues. But I would suggest going with the Brazilian attack to get those uh, goals, and obviously Jao Victor is very, very helpful. Or if you have Cunha's general in form as a winger, helpful as well obviously this could be massively upgraded there's lots of potential other strikers you could use um, you could even swap out the Chinese league uh, if you factor in a different league at the back you could go for Gabriel Jesus up front you know there's plenty of options this is just how I've built one way of doing it 
Um, but if you like the video, guys, please leave a like. If you want to subscribe to me, you can. Uh, make sure to check me out on all the socials below, especially TikTok. My name's Soapsy, and I'll see you guys later. Thank <laughs> you.